Welcome to the unboxing of a Tordex Apollos Evaluation Board. Before you open the package, make sure you are in an ESD-safe environment. Use appropriate ESD protection tools like a wristband and an ESD mat. Open carefully the package and take out the evaluation board. Unpack it and place it on your desk. Let's now have a look where the components are located. Now we will unpack and install the Apollos module. We are using an Apollos T30. Then take the module and align it to the evaluation board. Please pay attention that you choose the correct angle as you see here. When the module is aligned properly, push down until the two metal clips make a small snapping sound. Connect the power supply. To connect a monitor, take a VGA cable and connect it to the VGA port. Press the power button which is located near the power supply. Now you should see the boot process on the connected monitor. For having internet, we connect the ethernet cable. It is really easy to connect a mouse. Just plug it into the USB host and it is immediately functional. To connect to a computer, you can use the USB on the go. Connect the computer with a USB cable and use the Windows Mobile Device Center. This program will automatically start as soon as you connect the board. For additional debug information, you can use the serial port. Connect a serial cable to the RS-232 plug. Connect the other side of the cable to a serial port on your computer. If you don't have one, you can use an RS-232 to USB adapter as we are doing here.
To see the additional debug information, you will need to use a console. We recommend the free program TerraTerm. After you've configured TerraTerm properly, you can press the reset button and the debug information will appear. In addition to using the serial port, you can also use the USB port located next to the serial output. Unplug the serial cable and plug in a USB cable. When using this USB port, make sure the two jumpers behind the two serial ports are in the correct position. Because we want to show the additional debug information per USB, we have to change the two jumpers from TXRX to USB. Press the reset button and you'll again see the additional debug information. This is the end of the Apollos Evaluation Board unboxing. Please also take a look at our Hello World tutorial where we demonstrate how to write and debug a simple application on Toradex ARM modules.